Today's adventure brings me to Los Angeles Dodger Stadium for the Freeway Series. Angels of Anaheim, now the Los Angeles Angels, as they're referred to, and the Los Angeles Dodgers. Getting in here is a test in patience. Took a little while. It's about 45 minutes or so till first pitch. Welcome everyone out of the woo here as the recording of this August 8th, 2021. As you can see, I am wearing my appropriate Angels wear. Since I'm down in Orange County, I figured it appropriate. I've been rooting for them. It is 12.20 p.m. and first pitch at 1.10. Inviting you to join me. Shall you? And obviously it goes without saying, I will be outnumbered as far as having my my Anaheim LA Angels jersey on. I'm, I'm imagining there will be a few others that will be sporting it as well. So I figured it'd be fun to, to just see what happens. I got some, some inexpensive seats up in the upper deck. What can be better than that? So I will suggest heading Said over 20, to center. She just stated 25 minute wait over here, center field gate, no wait. I'm gonna follow that advice and head over to center field. Never mind. gonna take my chances over here at the left field, even though I will be sitting in right field. Gonna head through the left field gate. Doesn't look too bad as far as getting through the little checkpoints. Oh, I'm seeing a few other Angels folks as well. Nice. The Dodgers 2020 World Champions. As posted right up there. This is gonna be fun. All right, I am in. Heading over into the, the field. Now I will be sitting up there in that far corner, right way up there in the in the far in the far right first base first base right field side. Pretty interesting over here in the bullpen. They have seats kind of overlooking the bullpen down there. As one of the players from the Dodgers doing a stretching there, warming up in the bullpen, and just looking at a little bit of the merchandise here. Now, from what I've heard, there is a brand new flavor, a brand new company, or Dodger Dogs. I'm going to have to try one of the new Dodger Dogs. Even though I've heard a lot of people do not like the new Dodger Dogs, I'll have to find out for myself. Usually no batting practice during day games, because, you know, this game starts at 110 first pitch. But they do have, you know, a little bit of activity out there with the grounds crew all there preparing for first pitch. I am really into being in the shade, so I'm hoping there will be something like this similar in the upper deck that will be underneath because, yeah, the I don't do well being out in the sun for hours on end. But I do kind of have some inexpensive seats, so I might be able to shift around if it's not too busy up in the... You know, up in the, the area, kind of way up there in the outfield, and kind of search for shade like it is down here, except I'm not sitting down here. Making my way around to the first baseline. Now, they've just added what they call home run seats out here in not only left but right field. There's the, the right field home run seats. I contemplated getting one of those. Maybe I'll do those at another time. They're a little pricey. For this game, they were about $250. I opted for $36 seats, which compared to Angel Stadium, which I've used to been going to, ticket prices here are a little bit more. Nope, oh, nope, oh, in comparison. Oh, wait a second. We got, a, we got some drumming going on down here. how they have this little alcove area seats over behind the bullpen still need to make my way up to my seats which are up there 
We're still just kind of roaming around beforehand. Just walked up seven flights of stairs to get up here. Realize next time I'm here, if I'm in right field, go through the right field gates, you walk right in pretty much to where my upper deck seats will be as opposed to stair stepping it all the way up or waiting a lengthy line for the elevator. Hey, it's good future reference. I'll come in through the right field if I'm in right field upper deck seats again. I'm about to do the national anthem now. Still gotta make my way over to the seats over there in that corner. First pitch. Oh, oh, already a hit. Already now. Angels batting first because they are the away team. Now this freeway series here in August 2021, a three three games is all tied up. One and one, whoever wins this one wins the series. Even though the Angels are not doing as well as far as in the MLB as the Dodgers are. Not even sure if they will be making it to getting a wild card chance in the playoffs. Nonetheless, they are up to bat, and the hype is going to be a lot more for the Dodgers, obviously, because this is Dodgers home field as opposed to what I've been used to at Angel Stadium. So, also, I should show, I should show the view of where I'm at. I am way up here, and as the game progresses, I might move into other areas, like down to the outfield. And then maybe, you know, just kind of shift around. Got him out at first. Dang. I do enjoy having, also got myself a, a bottle of water, but I enjoy having plenty of leg room. You know, no one around, no one here. You get some of the inexpensive seats out in the, the upper deck at any stadium during a regular season game. Usually you have plenty of room, which is the way I like it. And you can always move down as the game progresses if you, it progresses if you see any empty seats, which trust me, I'm planning on doing. Maybe when the Angels are up to bat, especially Otani, can move down over into right field. I might even get lucky enough to, to get a home run. Still have not ca caught a home run ball. Ever. So you got Angels over here on first base. A little, a little pop-up foul ball into the upper decks. Well, second deck back behind home plate. Ended up getting a man on base. They walked him. Also noticing a lot of few people show up fashionably late. First pitch has already happened. And quite a few people already still are not in. I would imagine as the game progresses, the stands will fill up considerably. You can see them waiting to go through the checkpoint over there in the parking lot. Also, I parked way out there. Foul ball. That's the entrance I, I went in from. I may have made the wrong choice because it was, it was a, a like I said, a test in patience. It took a while to get in here. All right, Dodgers just scored. Oh man, the Dodgers are doing really well. They've already got a run in. Oh, check it out. There is a cotton candy vendor walking the aisles, the aisles down there through here. Probably don't come all the way up to the upper deck. However. I am starting to get a, a little craving for a hot dog. I'm gonna get one of those all new Dodger dogs. That's a whole tray of cotton candy down there. Okay, good to know. There is popcorn up here on the upper deck. So they do have they do have walking vendors all through the stadium, even up. Even up in the nether regions. As of right now, bases are loaded. For the Dodgers. It's not been a good first inning for the Angels. This time. Struck him out. Nice. Into the second inning now. You can still see plenty of people, line of cars arriving at the little stations over there. Pay for parking and making their way in. I always try to get here a little bit early. I always try to get to games early. That's just my own personal preference though. This state's 492 feet. From home plate, Dodgers are back up. I'm gonna go get myself a hot dog. Now time, something just happened. Couldn't decide which one I wanted, so I went with the super Dodger dog, which is right here 
in that sleeve, and the regular Dodger dog right over here in this sleeve. And at that particular stand, they said they do not have any diced onions or sauerkraut. They did have mustard, ketchup, and you know things like that. I went with the mustard. I'm not sure if that's completely an entire you know stadium thing or just the one stand I was at. Something's happening. Dang it! That can't be good. Well, it is good. Just heard them announce that Albert Pujols is up. Oh, that home run. That's a freaking home run. Dang it. I did manage to walk, walk, walk out of the tunnel when that happened though, so that was pretty spectacular. The price difference on these is the longer one was $7.75, shorter one was $6.75. Not much of a difference. It's hot dog time. Oh, they're boo Everyone's booing that I'm gonna consume this hot dog. Angels are back up. One thing I don't like about this angle is you don't really get a good, very good view of the scoreboard. I should be a little more specific. You can see the scoreboard with the player stats, but the scoreboard that has how many innings have been played, the runs, strikeouts, things like that, it's kind of obscured from that angle. Noticing down there, there's a, a little stand called Bow and Bowls. I might have to check that out at some point. Could be Bow Buns? I think at this point, I'm gonna take a little walk around. Right now it's the fifth inning. The scoreboard out here. I'm just gonna wander around and see what I can see and just go to some other seating areas and just meander. Going up, up, up to the farthest deck above home plate, known as the top of the park. Check out how many people are in line up here to get Dodger dogs and beverages. Wow. Even from way up here, kind of zoomed in a little bit, get a pretty good view of the, the dugout there, Angels dugout. Nice and breezy up here also. Skyline of downtown Los Angeles in the distance as well. Looks like got a bit of a wave going on. There it goes. There it comes. center field is this netting where you can sit, eat some snacks, have some beverages. And there's also another netting here, but you can kind of stand right in between here and look directly down where the batter's eye would be. Batter's eye being down there. Straight down to home plate.
cotton candy being delivered to the outfield. The right field over here. kicked out. One with an Angels jersey on. Giving some high fives on the way out. Warming up in the bullpen here. Pretty good view looking down into the bullpen. Number 67. It's the eighth inning right now. Ooh, a little pop in that glove. Okay, I moved down into the outfield seats. Otani is now up to bat. Oh, strike one. chant going on. No one's paying attention to the guy with the popcorn. Everybody's watching Otani. The popcorn does look really good though. Walked him. Walked him. <laughs> I do like the guy up here. Kind of up near where I was sitting except he's a little bit lower down. He's got the, the rally sweater, kind of swaying it around. He's wearing it over his head. Bases are loaded. like that the Los Angeles Dodgers have won against the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim I saw I still a refer to them pretty fun day my first experience the freeway series up attempting to get out of this parking lot which should be interesting got a huge congregation of people all with the same idea going across see a lot of cars in here and that's gonna do it for today from Dodger Stadium it was a good time and I stayed out of the Sun as much as possible a little bit of Sun in the outfield but I did find shade there's a lot of good shaded areas here at the stadium I'll see you in the next video the vlog it's over now to just find my vehicle somewhere in the sea of cars. Uh, cars. Also decided when, you know, over time as I go to more stadiums, I'm always going to root for my two quote-unquote home teams, which would be Anaheim, because you know, I live in Orange County, it would be the Anaheim Angels of Los Angeles, well, the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim. So when I go to another stadium, I'm hoping that they'll either be playing or the Tampa Bay, used to be the Devil Rays, but Tampa Bay Rays, because that is the closest team to my place out on the East Coast to Celebration Florida. Those will be my two quote unquote home teams. Now I will go to some, some other games that those teams are not playing, but if those teams happen to be playing, I will be rooting for them when I go to different stadiums.